What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today's video is about another fix to the PC port of Perfect Dark. This user has reported that the game world is squashed compared to the N64 and Xbox 360 version. So the first image is the N64 version, and then the second is the PC port. So yes, it is very, very squashed. And you can clearly see it, there's a blue line up there, and it does not look good when it's squashed. So we move over to the raw PC port 16x9, and then to the Xbox 360 version. Which honestly, I hope we get these textures and stuff on um, the PC version. Look at this. Yeah, it is legit night and day. So he made a fix for this, and we are gonna go apply it. So I'm gonna go with a code, and we're gonna go down here, and we're gonna grab the newest build and it's going to download for us of course and what I want to do is open it open it open it god damn it nana zip flashbang light mode and we're going to go to documents and as you can see I have my GEPD edition there and of course this version right here is my game what we're going to do is we're going to copy all this into here we're going to hit replace files. And then we're going to boot the game up. And now the game should no longer look squashed. Alright, we're in. Let me just max that out. I need to also make sure that OBS is good. Oh yeah, this looks a lot better. So I've actually been running through some stuff. Let's go to the Institute. Oh, the lights are so bad in this game. I hate them. Because I have high FOV on, it's kind of hard to tell the difference. But yeah, it, it doesn't look squashed no more. It looks correct. Which is really nice. And you could tell because the PC in front of us is actual resolution. So let's head to um, my favorite level. And let's try this out. Alright. Yeah, this looks much better now. It looks way less squashed. Sit. I missed that one so bad. Ooh, there was a delay in firing. That was weird. So it doesn't look like it's broken anything. I mean, there's collision on these walls, so we can't exactly see through them even if we move in a certain direction. Fall. Fall. Yeah, get Lannistered. Ah, I made a reference. All right, he's dead. Got him! Ha <laughs> ha First time for everything. I've never actually gotten that guy before he's come down before, so... Got you. Another guy should pop up through here. Possibly. Let's go up this way. Got you. Hey guys. Ooh, that was audio jitter. Did you hear that? That was really weird. I've never actually heard that before. So I can confirm the audio stutter. In certain scenarios. Because you were a bad guy.
I love it. In reality, you shoot someone in the head, they're just gone. But in this game, pop, and he's like, he's moving around like he's gonna survive. Yeah, that doesn't make no sense. Can we go out here? We can't. I hate that. I want these doors unlocked. Here. You Jackie Chan. Alright. Hi. There's an intruder. Are you at high alert? Click you, click you. Oh, this feels so much better. This is so much nicer. It's a weird how the smallest can change can make like the biggest effect on things. And I don't even know what I'm gonna be able to title this video. Did we just call it the game was squashed and now it's fixed? I don't know. I mean, that seems about right. No key card this time. There's always a random chance that the key card is in here. Not that time though. You good? Your gun work now? Oh, thank you. Ah, there's the key card. We're done. Mission time was 407. Was I screwing around? It was worse than my last time. I don't know. Anyway, uh game no longer squished at 16 by 9 or 4 by 9 or 4 by 3, so you know, it's a good thing. And now the FOV looks correct. So enjoy the game some more, because this is apparently some people's addiction, and I can honestly see why. And I love covering this. This is a great PC for it. And I hope you guys download it and enjoy it. See you guys in the next video. Hit the like button, subscribe. Go check the guy out on GitHub. Hit the star button on the guy's GitHub. And I'll see you in the next video.